Recent attacks by Al-Shabaab militants on Amisom camps in Somalia have raised concerns about the security situation in the country. It appears the mission, whose mandate is to reduce the threat posed by the militants and assist the Somali government to expand its control, is failing. Reports that the mission lost control of the port city of Marka don't help the situation. Amazon has, however, denied these allegations. Recently, the African Union sent a delegation to Marka to assess the situation there. I'm dominating this area by patrol. I'm putting ambushes both day and night. And then we also have a detachment now. SNA came, we have a detachment of SNA located in this very location. At the same time, the population are very positive. We are cooperating with the population. The population is supporting Amisom operation. They are giving us information despite threats and intimidation from Al-Shabaab. Okay. The delegation also looked at ways of assisting Somali security institutions alongside Amisom troops execute their mandate. The visit was also to evaluate the mission's readiness for the upcoming presidential and parliamentary elections scheduled later this year. Our visit here is precipitated on finding out the preparedness of troops uh, to support uh, this political process. Uh, the second uh, key aspect of the visit is, as you may be aware, uh, last year in August, um, AMISOM, uh, our mission here and of course AU headquarters, uh, produce a new concept of operations and this visit is to find out how that concept of operations in support of the political process of, uh, of Somalia is, is, is unfolding. Amisom has been struggling with funding among other challenges. The AU delegates hope the feedback from the visit will help marshal support for Amisom to enable it support the federal government of Somalia to help realize lasting peace and stability in the country. Susan Mongeli, CCTV.